fly and butterfly have hair rolls on their body which helps them to breathe plant plant breathe through their tiny pores on their leaf thank you hi good morning my name is rk satyanayan narayanan of grade 3a we all know lunar and solar eclipses occur every year but what are these two eclipses all about today i am going to explain you with the help of this model we all know the earth revolves the sun thus causing day and night the moon revolves the earth the moon reflects the light of the sun a solar eclipse occurs when the moon blocks the light of the sun the shadow of the moon falls on the earth and sun cannot be seen a lunar eclipse occurs when the earth blocks the light of the sun the shadow of the earth falls on the moon and the moon cannot be seen hope you like the my model thank you I'm going to tell about states and capitals. Let's play our states and capitals. Jammu and Kashmir, Sri Lanka, Madhya Pradesh, Bhutan. Uttar Pradesh, Lucknow. Telangana, Hyderabad, Tamil Nadu, Chennai, Jharkhand, Ranchi, राजस्थान जयपुर गुजरात गांधीनगर वेस्ट बंगाल कोलकाता नेक्स्ट केरला तिरुवनंतपुरम कर्नाटक बेंगलुरु उड़ीसा भुवनेश्वर नेक्स्ट पंजाब चंडीगढ़ नेक्स्ट आंध्र प्रदेश अमरावती थैंक यू हाय फ्रेंड्स आई एम रियाना फ्रॉम थर्ड ए शुड वी प्ले अ गेम Yes. I have five different clocks. By seeing the clocks, can you name the bird? No, Rihanna. It's a little difficult. Can you give us the clue? Yes, I can. Then we play. It ha- it has the bird to hold the branch. It has three toes in front and one at back. Can you name the bird? It's a sparrow. Yeah, it's a sparrow. It has webbed feet. It can swim. Can you name the bird? I think it's a duck. Yeah, it's a duck. 
Okay. It can climb trees. It has two toes pointing upwards and two toes pointing downwards. Can you name the bird? It can climb tree. I don't know, Rihanna. It's a woodpecker. Oh, it's a woodpecker. Thank you. It it has long and thin, thin legs with spread out toes. It can walk through muddy waters. Can you name the bird? It's a heron. Yeah, it's a heron. It digs the ground. It has strong legs with three toes in front and one at back. Can you name the bird? I think it's a hen. Yeah, it's a hen. Oh, superb. I hope you all enjoyed the game. Yes? Yeah, Rihanna. I enjoy. Have a great day. Thank you. Bye. Hi guys, I am Ashka. Today I am going to talk about the colorful north, Delhi. Delhi is situated along the banks of River Yamuna. Delhi is the capital of National Capital Territory. New Delhi is capital of India. Delhi was planned by the Sir Edwin Lutyens. The main the main officer, government offices are located in New Delhi. People speak different languages. Thus, we can call Delhi a mini India. Delhi Transport Corporation operates thousands of buses every day. Red Fort and Jama Masjid are built by Shah Jahan. Rajkat, Lodi Garden, Lotus Temple, India Gate, Kutub Minar, are the main tourist attraction in Delhi. Chandigarh. Chandigarh is a union territory. It is the capital of two states, Punjab and Haryana. It is well-planned city designed by French architect Deco Bessier. Summer are very hot and winter are very cold. People speak Punjabi, Hindi and English. M most people visit Rock Garden. Sakir Hussein Rose Garden is one of the biggest garden in Asia. Lucknow. Lucknow is the capital of Uttar Pradesh. It is also known as city of Nawabs. It is situated along the banks of River Gurti. People speak in Hindi, Urdu and English. Chicken embroidery is famous in Lucknow. Bara Mambra, Chota Mambra, the residency, Rumi Darwaza, Clock Tower are the famous tourist attraction in Lucknow. Thank you. Hi friends, my name is Madhumita. I am studying the standard in Magvidyalaya. I am going to explain about digestive system. Digestion is the process of breaking down the food into simple form. It's called digestion. The digestion starts in our mouth. When we chew the food, it uh, mixed with saliva and becomes soft. Once the food becomes soft, it goes to the stomach. Through food pipe, in the stomach, the food mixed in, in the uh, digestion juices. After 4 hours, the food goes to the small intestine and further digestion. The blood vessels are uh, present in the small intestine and take, take the energy uh, from the digested food. gives a various parts of our body. The undigested food goes to the large intestine and uh, the blood vessels present in the large intestine. And it takes the extra water. A uh, semi-solid waste goes through anus. Thank you. Good morning. My name is Siddha. I am studying the standard. I am going to tell about the parts of speech. There are eight 
verb. Describe actions or experience. Example, run, walk, push, eat. Sophie ran to school because she was late. Ran is the verb. Now, name the person, place, things or idea. Example, house, teacher, up, shop. My teacher is a very nice person. Teacher is the noun. Adjective. Describe a noun or preposition. Pronoun. Example, short, beautiful. She is the beautiful girl. Beautiful in the sentence. Beautiful is the adjective. Adverb. Describe the verb and adjective or an adverb. Example, slowly, yesterday, always. Sophie is always late to school. Always is the adverb. Pronoun. Replace the noun. Name of the person, place, things, or place, things, or idea in the sentence. Example, I, she, or it. Vishal is nice boy. He always helps me. He, in the sentence, he is the pronoun. Interjection. Explanation. Strong emotion with explanation mark. Walk. Example, walk. Oh, wow, the view is amazing. Wow, in the sentence, wow is in the direction. Conjection. Connect words in the in a sentence. Example, and, and, but, or. I like to watch TV and eat popcorn. In the sentence. In the sentence, and is conjunction. Preposition. Describe place, time, or this. It is used before noun, pronoun. Example, under, about, during. Cat, the cat is jumped over the ball. In the sentence, over is the preposition. Thank you. Hello, I'm Nanda from third grade. I'm going to tell about types of beaks. Strong, sharp, and who could be eagle, vultures, hawks, kites, and owls or birds of prey. This, they have strong, sharp, and who could beaks to tear flesh. Short, hard and pointed beak. This type of beak helps it to pick up and crush grains and seeds. Example, sparrow, pigeon, peacock and finches. Strong and curved beak. This curved beak helps it to crack nuts and hard fruits and also climb. Also helps it to climb trees. Example, parakeet. Strong and chisel shaped beak. This beak helps it to tap the bark of the trees and take out insects. Example, woodpecker. Broad and short beak. The broad and short beak of a swallow is sticky on the inside. Long and slender beak. A hoopy is able to pull out insects from hole in the ground. Broad and flat beak. The broad and flat beak of a duck has tiny holes on the sides. Thank you.
எல்லாருக்கும் வணக்கம் என் பேர் ஸ்ரீநாஷ்பா நான் மூன்றாம் வகுப்பு படிக்கிறேன் நான் நெ நெகிழிப்பை தீமைகள் பற்றி சொல்ல போ பேசப் போகிறேன் நெகிழிப்பை நம் உலகத்திற்கு மிகவும் தீமையானது மாடுகளும் மற்ற உயிரினங்களும் இதை உண்பதில் பாதிப்படைகிறது நாம் இதை பயன்படுத்துவதை தவிர்க்க வேண்டும் அதற்கு பதிலாக துணிப்பை அல்லது காகிதை பையை பயன்படுத்த வேண்டும் நன்றி வணக்கம் குட் ஈவினிங் ஃப்ரெண்ட்ஸ் டுடே ஐ எம் கோயிங் டு ஷோ மை போட் எக்ஸ்பிரிமெண்ட் இட் இஸ் மேடப்பா ஆஃப் தர்மாகோல் டிசி மோட்டார் நைன் வோல்ட் பேட்டரி வித் கேப் The battery is generating the power with the uh, while it is connecting to the DC motor or then it will move. See how it's moving. Thank you. Hi all. I am Angel and Jessica. I am studying third grade. Today I am going to explain about kidneys. What are kidneys? Kidneys are two bean shaped organs each about a size of your our fist. They are located just below of our rib cage. One on each side of our Kidneys, kidneys filter the blood and the waste water comes from the blood is called urine. Kidney removes the urine. Parts of kidneys. These two are kidneys and these two are ureter and this is the bladder and this is the ureter. Thank you. Hi, I am Sri Ganesh. Now I am going to explain about birds. Birds are vertebrates with wings and feathers. Most birds can fly using powerful muscles to flap their wings. Birds hatch from mids. Birds have different beaks and claws. Thank you. Everybody, I am Shamri. I am studying in third grade. Which my topic is for. safety at home we should not live we should not live toys bags and shoes on the floor we you or someone get trip over them take medicines only after asking an adult we should not touch sharp things like knife scissors and blades we should not touch electric gadgets and switches with wet hands because you may get the electric shock fire can hurt you very badly so be careful with stoves hot pans and boiling water hi i am sandika from today today i am going to explain about safety at classroom you should not sharpen your pencils with blade you should sharpen your pencils with sharpener You should not stand on the bench or chairs. You should not pull anyone when the person is walking in the stairs. When the person gets hurt, you should inform your teacher. You should you should not run in the classroom. Thank you. Hello everyone. I am Shashank of third grade. Today I am going to talk about types of roots what is a root the part of the the part of the plant which is under the soil is called a root function of a root root helps the plant to be fixed firmly to the ground they help them to absorb water and nutrients from the soil
in some plants roots also store extra food made by the plants types of fruits the three main types of roots are tap root fibrous root and adventitious root tap root tap roots are roots which which have one main root in the center and smaller roots come, come out of the main root most plants which have intersecting lines on their leaves have tap root example carrot turnip beetroot fibrous root in a fibrous root many small roots grow from the base of the stem there is no main root in a fibrous root system most plants which have parallel lines on their leaves have fibrous root example corn wheat and rice adventitious roots adventitious roots are roots which grow from another part of a plant such as stem branch etc there are different types of adventitious roots depending on the function they perform tuberous root stores excess food of the plant example sweet potato stilt roots and prop roots provide support example banyan maize aerial roots help to breathe and climbing roots help to climb example orchids and ivy thank you